In order to be a good interpreter, though, I had to work on my memory. And one of memory enhancement techniques is memorization through associations, which is what I'm going to demonstrate today. And for demonstration purposes, I am going to use my name. I will help you to memorize its spelling, because I know it can be challenging, can't it? <laughs> are you excited to try this? Oh, yes. 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 And are you ready for some weird stuff? <laughs> <laughs> you know why? Because that helps to memorize. Okay, let's do it. Imagine that I am a zebra, because I can be very controversial, like black and white zebra stripes, but more. Imagine that I am a zebra who is wearing a bra. <laughs> it's weird, right, you think? <laughs> this zebra must be ill. <laughs> we need to check. But how to do it? We need to take her temperature. But how to do it without a thermometer? This is what I suggest. Take one of the L letters and use it as a thermometer to take my temperature. And remove that bra. Zebras don't wear bras. There, you're left with my name, Ilze or rather Ilze, which is just a name, it has no meaning. Yet my surname, Berzina, or rather Berzina, does have a meaning. It means a young birch tree. Birch trees are white with black stripes, like zebras. But I'm not going to challenge you to remember my surname. Call me simply Ilze B because that's the name that I have adopted. I call myself Ilze B, thus telling myself, Ilze, be who you are. And that's what I'm going to do. I am here to talk about things that make me vulnerable and about black and white life matters. <laughs> 